Welcome to another episode of Panko Plays Stray of Seasons Trio of Towns. Alright, we are on day eight. We are on day eight. Oh, and something is in here. This is my mailbox. We'll receive letters. Yay, let's read it. So we have, we've got new products and thank you for your hard work for completing the 10 jobs. So that's really, really exciting. And I told you those radishes would be ready. So we've got some nice radishes going. We're going to have some good radishes to sell. Now we can start selling vegetables. When people ask us to ship vegetables, we will be able to ship them. So go ahead and, and use our watering can immediately on this radish. And we're going to have to go get more seeds because we can't make seeds yet, which kind of sucks. But it'll, it'll come. It'll come. And all the squeaking in the background is uh, little pine, my, my little pine coves. They're playing. So... There, so there'll be a lot of squeaking in the background. Do do do! They're playing with Mr. Panko. So good morning to our chicken. He's got a nice egg for us, and he seems happy and healthy. It's not raining today, so we're gonna put him outside. Do 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 do! There we go. Go ahead, Cluck, and let's check out Moors. Hi, Moors. We're gonna give you a nice, a uh, nice brush after we pet you because we got to make sure you stay nice and clean and then we're going to milk you do, 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 do. there we go and then we are going to give a soft treat doom all right let's go and push push this cow out sometimes i wish you could pick up the cow ah get outside get outside booers and then as always we check our animal notebook because i have a terrible memory and i need to make sure that everything's happened oh my goodness they didn't eat okay put them back inside put them back inside abort so if you put them outside too early they will get super hungry and they won't eat all right sorry guys that got a little loud there uh Cl clara was demonstrating what pandas sound like because you know, that is what pandas sound like. Screaming children. Um, <laughs> kids! Yay! So sorry if you guys couldn't hear me there. Hopefully we'll be able to get this back on track. So if you put your animals out too early, they won't eat. That is something, that's one really nice thing about having the um, animals or that, that herd them. Because then we don't have to worry about something like that. So... Really, really great. Okay, so now you've eaten. So get your butt, butt, get your butt outside. Get your butt outside. La 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 la. Okay, so here you go. Do do do. So I was talking about the food power in the last episode. So I did actually figure that out. So they w will food will remain in uh, effect for approximately two in-game hours. So that gives you a very good idea of the uh, of of the amount of time that you have for that food. Do do. Okay, there we go. We're gonna do an axe here. We're gonna chop down this tree, and it's gonna be fun and games. Fun and games, fun and games, chopping down a tree. We're gonna chop, chop this tree right down. We're gonna chop, chop, chop this tree right down. We're gonna get some stuff and chop down this tree. All right, there we go. One more chop. I need better tools. Oh God, okay. Whew. That was, that was really long. That was a really, really long time to chop that branch. I am super impatient because I just, I just want to move on in this game. I just want to get to spring year two because that's when, that's when it's like everything's unlocked and you're like working on your town ranks and that's when it gets really good. So we found a piggyback lotus. Do, 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 do. And we got some mint. Now I'm going to show you guys because we're picking up some mint and that's actually one of the doctor's favorite foods. So whose name? I still can't remember. Uh oh. <gasps> About fishing. Yay. Huh? Oh, howdy, Pango. Didn't hear you there. Mm hmm. What? Though I go fishing for the first time, thought I'd go ship fishing for the first time in quite, 
quite a few. I was putting these on pizza tonight. Mmm, yeah, I mean, no, yum. <laughs> Since you're here, how about I give you a quick pointers on how to fish? Hooray, I would love to fish. This is how you fish. You can go fishing anywhere along the water. Just equip your fishing rod and press the A button to cast your line. Once the bob is in the water, you'll see fish-shaped shadows popping up. As soon as one grabs your line, press the A button. If the time is right, you'll hook the fish. Yeah. If you have trouble seeing the shadows, use a control pad to move the camera around to get a better angle. I understand it all. And that's about all I got to tell you. When you got some cash to spare, go on and buy a new fishing rod. It'll be fun. That's what the new item was. Oh, it's exciting. We're getting a fishing rod. I love fishing. Oh, and the plums are ready. Today is just a great day. So it is starting to pick up. You'll notice that every day we have more and more things to do. And that is one of the things I really like about Story of Seasons games is, is they just like the playability of them. You could pick up a game you hadn't touched in a really long time. Please feed your sheep woman. And it would just be... It would just be like you you didn't even stop playing. So, And I do like the fact that you can fish in more than one spot. In the previous game, you could only fish in one spot. And that was quite annoying. I did not like that at all. Um, so even though we talked to Frank in kind of cutscene, it still doesn't count as talking to Frank. So we do have to make sure we go see him. What is with these people? They're not feeding any other animals. I'm calling animal control on all of these towns, folk. This is absolutely ridiculous. I demand animals to be fed. Tell him we should start a petition for Story of Seasons characters to actually feed people. There we go. Horatio says there are jobs to do. Ford! That's his name. <laughs> Look, okay, so we don't quite have two milk yet, and I know we don't have flowers yet, so let's do the weeding job that Ford said. Now, good thing about the weeding job is we get to keep these weeds, but downside to the weeding job is weeds are not as valuable as they were in the other games. So they definitely did a lot of fixing for each of the... Um, items and like how to get fertilizer they just they just added another level to the intensity and the and the thought process of the game which which is really enjoyable like all all around it's definitely uh, a better game than the first story of seasons that that I've played so we got 165 gold there thank you Ford that was very nice of you and now we're gonna give Ford a gift so we're gonna go in and doo -doo, I said I was going to romance everybody. I do have in mind who I actually am going to uh, marry in the end. But um, that's just because I'd like. So he says, is this for me? An excellent choice. You have a firm grasp of my preferences. Now to use in an experiment sample or to save it for another use? That is the question. Hmm. It seems your energy is infectious. For I am feeling much better now that you have my thanks. Now giving them a present does not mean you talk to them. So you do still have to press that button and talk to them. So now I've done both things. And that's going to slowly raise my relationship with Ford. And make him all swoon for me. So la la la. Let's talk to Miranda. Let's see how she's doing. Now her shop doesn't have anything new. But we did need some, uh, some seeds. So let's go ahead and buy some seeds. We'll buy radish seeds. We'll buy two of those. And I do like my potatoes. So we'll buy three potatoes. And that should fill... Oh, I didn't mean to go back in. Do we need anything else? Hmm. Might as well get a couple more fertilizer. Could always need fertilizer if you remember to use it. Did I use it on the potatoes? You can leave a comment in the comment section below if I did use it on the potatoes or if I didn't use it in the potatoes. <laughs> Hello, that's that. Because I can't remember. Huh. How long has it been? I don't know like 10 minutes in all right we're gonna go in and we're gonna say hi to brad who always feeds us really nice and then we're gonna go say hi to marco what are you doing today marco do you still feel like a million g oh i like your smile nice and honest well that's probably why people let me do things i work really really hard la 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 la, la. okay we're gonna walk this way do, do, do. We don't have any more jobs to do, but we're going to talk to Wayne quickly. Hello, Wayne. I can't give you any treats yet because you like coffee and it's not for sale yet. When the coffee is for sale, we will definitely go ahead and start giving him po coffee packs. That is one way to make him like us. So, what was it? No, it's no, I don't think it's Natasha that has the new, the new item. Let's want Natasha. Maybe it actually was the... the uh, Maybe it actually was our 
our store. No, no, it was the general store. There we go. Here's the fishing rod. So we are buying a fishing rod. Yay. I'm so excited. So we get to fish today. We get to fish today. This is exciting. Let's go fishing. So you can't put um, bait on it yet. Uh, you will have to do that again. Most most things are... Uh, uh, you'll find me saying Ludicolo a lot. <laughs> Most of things are available at that point. So, uh, da, da. go ahead, giant honeybee. Okay, so we're going to fishing rod it up. Okay, so we cast our fishing rod, and then we we can move our camera around using our control our control sticks, but we don't really need to. Here comes that fish. The fish is going to pull a little bit, and once it gets the bob under the water, that is when you press A. So you'll see it goes down. And you press A, and then that's it. You only press A once, and then you'll reel in whatever it is. Could be a boot, could be a fish, and here you go. Now that did take stamina, and now we have an we're now we're an amateur amateur angler, and we're gonna go ahead. And it should be high time to get some food. La 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 la. So really, we're starting to get into the game. Once we get the hammer, we'll be able to start mining, and we're just we're just getting playing. So you see how it does start out a little bit slow, but then it then it doesn't. So we can say hi to them, but they won't ask us to eat with them yet because they don't they don't know us yet. They have no hearts of love, no hearts of love. Okay, we're gonna order food. So ooh, we know that that eggs Benedict gives us the fishing, uh, the fishing thing, which. Sounds like it might be something that we should do. Ooh, because we know we're going to want to fish today. You know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it. I'm going to get the eggs benedict again. We're not going to do that again tomorrow, though. We're only going to do it today because we do want that fishing stamina. And off the top of my head, I don't know which one of the other ones might give us that. And having the recover stamina heart should get us through the rest of the day. Okay, thank you so much, Brad, for giving me food, raising the, the town rank a little bit, and I'll show you. We're going to fish in all the fishing spots we can fish in currently, so that you guys can get an idea of the fact that you can just pull out your fishing rod anywhere, which is so different and new and fun, and a honeybee! And it, yeah, I see the eagle. I see the eagle, guys. It's pretty cool. Imagine if, like, your familiar was an eagle, just, like, on you. So let's come. We can uh, we can fish beside Marco. Oop. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, and fish beside Marco here. So y if you're fishing beside somebody else, especially in something like multiplayer, uh, it, it can get a little confusing. Mr. Panko likes to stand with me so that the uh, fishing ball goes over top of mine, so I never know when to press A. Um, we do that to annoy each other because I'm going to show you some stuff in... Um, I'm going to show you some stuff in multiplayer with him eventually in this series. So that's going to be super fun to do. La, la, la. We are fishing, 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 fishing. Yeah. And come on, little fish. Come on, little fish. Don't be a rock. You got to wonder how that rock bounced up and down so much, right? Yay, I got a bluegill. Okay, now we're going to go to another spot. Ooh, Let's go over here. I like fishing over here because it's got the waterfalls. And you can even fish at the waterfalls. Like, look at this. Look, we're just fishing in the waterfall. It's kind of awesome. I like the idea that you can use the fishing rod wherever you want to, just like in real life. Uh, and that is a nice rock. But let's try to get a fish in all of the spots because, you know, then we're, we're going to get maybe different fish, maybe new fish, maybe exciting fish, maybe multicolored fish, maybe this kind of fish or that kind of fish. Uh, no, just some rocks. So we'll just try again. That rock looks suspiciously like a fish. I don't know. So let's go. Let's go. Oh, it's, it's turning away. It's turning away. Maybe it actually is a fish this time. I don't know if the rock would turn away. Oh, that's a little bit harder. Oh, it's a lop. Well, okay, it looks like a lobster, but it's a crayfish. Look at all the stuff we're getting. We're going to fill up our storage. We're going to have to start selling some of this. Well, let's go. And there's one more place in the early game that you can fish, and I bet you remember seeing it. There we go. So getting to fish in all these different spots is really nice. So maybe we'll take a couple minutes and we'll get some fish in this particular spot, standing beside this fox. You can give um, some stuff to the wild animals. That is also a possibility. So don't forget that. Come on, come on, come on. You're going, going, going. 
So we got a black bass, and it's a new, I've set a new record for that kind. So same kind of fish here and there. Uh, definitely, definitely fishing is one of those things that I really enjoy doing in these games. Um, I definitely love the changes they've made to it in this game. Oh, I pressed A too fast. And I, you will also be able to customize the color of our rod too. So that's really exciting. In this game, you stick with the tools that you started with in the beginning and you just upgrade them. And I think that gives a little bit more personality to them for sure. So that's the first time we've caught that one. So let's fish in this spot one more time. And then we'll head back to our fields. We should be able to plant those seeds, water our crops, and fertilize. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Got loud behind there. There was a very intense situation. Yay, crayfish. Got 14 centimeter crayfish. Did I say one more time? I meant two more times. It's see me and the fishing. You're going to find that I fish a lot. I, I, I do. I really, really enjoy fishing. So, and for multiplayer, that's really all there is to do. So that's going to be very interesting. So we got a smelt. See, it's a good thing I, I stayed. So we got a few there. And, oh, that's a grasshopper. Oh, it's a migratory locust and a scarab beetle. Remember when the scarab beetles used to make a whole bunch of noise? And the last game, if you've played it, is definitely something that, that did happen. So, come on, there we go. You go inside. You go inside. So we definitely got fishing immature. I'm gonna uh, just make sure we've added some more food. I just don't want him to run out of any food. He does have seven days of food, but sometimes I get distracted. So this time Wayne is checking our box. Wayne, I got no, I got no stuffs for you. Ooh. And seeds are right here, so we're gonna go ahead and we'll put a radish seed here and a radish seed here. And then we will do three potato seeds. So I did buy exactly what I was hoping I would buy. So there we go. And now we're gonna water everything. So we're definitely getting more and more stuff each day, making our farm a little bit better. And it's a positive thing all the way around. Thing, thing, thing. How many times have I said thing? <laughs> Repeating yourself is fun, and it's why you guys watch. Yeah, so definitely uh, enjoying making these uh, episodes. It is a little, little bit tricky to make sure that they go up. I would like to increase how fast they do, but it, it's just getting the time to actually, to actually play. So um, if you guys are liking, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and and all that good stuff. And I will eventually start shiny hunting again for anybody who is wondering where the shiny hunting went. Uh, I just like needed a quite a long break. That's all. Breaks are needed sometimes. So I didn't put fertilize this potato. So I'm really glad that I checked. Now we have a lot of stamina and I know it's 19 o'clock. I'm staying up so late, but I just want to go back uh, and find that la find those couple of trees that we were working on and use our stamina. There's no point in going to bed this early in the game with any stamina. If you can use it, I really suggest you do. Um, it's just making sure that you've, um, that you've uh, efficiently, efficiently done everything that you can do. So I think our farm is looking pretty good. I think we've got as much lumber as we can. And I'm gonna take out all lumber and chop it at the same time so that I don't waste any of that stamina. So just one moment and I will go do that. We're gonna open our storage. We're gonna remove some items. We're gonna go ahead and remove. Okay, first we'll sort uh, everything. So I'm gonna merge it all because right now I don't care about the l different levels of, st of the the foods and stuff. So I'm going to take out these branches and all 16 of our twigs. And we don't have a hammer yet, so that's good. Okay, now we'll go put them outside and we'll axe them up. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. I know I say we don't have a hammer a lot, but now we have 51 more branches, so we're going to place them. We're definitely going to be able to upgrade our house. We'll just have to get some stone now. Um, very excited about that because we live in a shanty. Do, 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 do. And I'd like to not live in a shanty. There we go. All right, so we are gonna end up going to sleep with some stamina. We've got, ooh, we got two awards today to look at. So let's go and check out 
our trophies. Oh, we're at 2%, guys. Okay, so we've collected at least 100 pieces of wood. And... Oh, and we got our f used our fishing rod for the very first time. So, got lots of awards to go. Oh, and we have two different kinds of radishes here. This one has 23% of our... Because we were fertilizing it, it's got a little bit more color. So that is great. We are doing fantastic. I'm actually just going to merge all these fish. All the fish get merged. We're going to have to fish more, definitely. Fish are a good thing. They also um, are ingredients for food for pets, which... Uh, pets and chicken feet, I think. So that is one reason why I'm paying a little bit more attention to them. And I accidentally put our treats away. Whoopsies. Let's find those treats. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Where are our treats? Or at least I thought I put our treats away. Oh, well. Okay, so tomorrow we have on the calendar that it's Noelle's birthday. So we do have to make sure we remember that. Thank you, everyone, for watching. I uh, really enjoyed playing this with you today. And, uh... Yeah, another episode done of Story Pineco Plays, Story of Seasons Trio of Towns. I hope all of your crops are golden.